Let's take you out to one of the foggiest shots that we have. This is a live look from Salem, our travel Salem camera. Um, and the fog has certainly settled in in the central and southern Willamette Valley where the wind is light and that temperature has cooled down a bit. It's 50 degrees up. Actually, you know what? It's pretty mild there, but uh, thanks to partially clear skies, uh, the fog has a actually settled in, but closer to the Columbia River up near Portland, we have enough of a breeze to mix out the air and that has kept the temper or the, the fog from developing west side of the metro area. Uh, Beaverton Hillsboro, uh, there are some areas of dense fog out there and as you travel through the gorge, the east end of the gorge into the Columbia River Basin is dealing with some fog where temperatures are in the 30s. It's 34 in Hood River, 33 in Salem, 44 in Portland and we're in the upper 40s to mid 50s out along the coast. Here's a live look outside from our Shia Lewin's camera in Seaside. Most of the day is going to end up being dry out there, but I think by this evening, some showers are going to start to sneak their way on shore. So uh, just keep that in mind. Temperatures are going to be real nice out there in the low to mid 60s with a breezy southeast wind at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Our interior valleys are obviously starting off some areas of fog down to the south and away from the gorge or at least the, uh, near the mouth of the gorge. Uh, temperatures will be pretty nice out there, upper 50s uh, to low 60s. That cool east wind coming out of the gorge should keep temperatures a bit cooler near the Columbia River. The gorge will max out in the 40s. Expect some uh, lower visibility on the east end of the gorge at least through this morning and a breeze east wind on the west end of the gorge. The Mount Hood area will see building cloud cover, a dry day with temperatures in the 40s and 50s this afternoon. In central and eastern Oregon, you can expect areas of fog to the north uh, from the Dalles, perhaps out to Pendleton, uh, but points to the south are going to have a lot of sunshine today with highs in the 40s and 50s. Our seven day forecast for the metro area shows a few showers coming in potentially tomorrow. More frequent showers Wednesday into early Thursday. Once that weather system slides inland, we're going to see some cooler air uh, come in and that's going to allow those temperatures to dip into the mid 40s this weekend with overnight lows trending into the 30s. Tony.